Here are another 10 Marvel movie details you might have missed. In Spider-Man Homecoming, look at this scene. Everyone was impressed. Come on! Happy honked because they almost hit something. But if you pay attention, you can see that Peter's spidey sense already noticed it, which is why he looked forward twice. Everyone was impressed. Come on! In the ending of Avengers Endgame, during Tony Stark's funeral, his daughter says this. What do you want? Cheeseburgers. You know, your dad likes cheeseburgers. Okay. This is actually a very touching moment because in Iron Man 1, Tony says this. I've been in Cheer. captivity for three months. There are two things I want to do. I want an American cheeseburger. Oh, burger. You have to have a burger. Yeah. Well, come on. In Sam Raimi's Spider-Man 1, look at this scene. Notice that when Green Goblin breaks Peter's web, it sounds like metal. This shows how really strong Peter's web is, that it is comparable to or even stronger than metal. Misery, misery, misery. In the ending of Spider-Man No Way Home, when Peter visits MJ. Uh, right, yeah. Uh, yeah. You can see that MJ still wears the broken black Dahlia necklace Peter gave her in Far From Home. So maybe MJ still remembers Peter, but she does not know what he looks like. Spider-Man? In Captain America Civil War, how can Vision fly here? Well, Vision has the ability to increase or decrease the weight of his body, so he changes his weight to be so light that he can float. You can actually see here that whenever he flies, his body becomes a little transparent. In Thor Ragnarok, look at this scene. Strongest Avenger. Access denied. Point Break. Welcome, Point Break. <laughs> the reason Point Break works is because, in Avengers 1, Tony mocks Thor by using it. No hard feelings, Point Break. You got a mean swing. In Avengers Endgame, Ant-Man comes out of the quantum realm after five years, but for him, it's just five hours. I'm sorry, that must have been a very long five years. Yeah, but that's just it. For me, it was five hours. However, when Janet was inside for 30 years, she still aged 30 years. This is because Ant-Man fell into a time vortex while Janet just lived her life normally in the quantum realm. And don't get sucked into a time vortex. We won't be able to save you. In Thor Ragnarok, look at this scene. We know each other. He's a friend from work. This dialogue was actually created by a kid watching on the set. A young kid on set who was uh, unwell at the time and had come to visit, and he was on the sideline. He's like, "Why don't you say, look up at, at Loki in the crowd? So he's a, he's a friend from work. He's a friend from work." If Odin was supposed to be the protector of the nine realms, why didn't he help against Loki in Avengers One? Well, he actually did help, but because the Bifrost was broken after Thor won, he couldn't send his army. However, he still used most of his dark energy to send his strongest combatant, which is Thor. With the Bifrost gone, how much dark energy did the Old Father have to muster to conjure you here? In Avengers Endgame, how did Tony Stark come up with the idea to steal the stones instead of the gauntlet? At the start of the fight, everyone is fighting to get the gauntlet, but when this happens... <laughs> Thanos removes the Power Stone to fight Captain Marvel. This is the moment Tony notices that he can just remove the stones instead of pulling off the gauntlet. 